my dear scholars we have been learning how the resources of course the resources are required without resources any firm a firm may it be for profit not for profit cannot survive but the question is if these resources are available to everyone then how are you going to develop advantage that is the question which needs to be answered and i think resource based view of the firm as compared to the economic based view of the firm helps us to understand to develop an edge over other firms rb view certainly takes a view takes a perspective that for effective and efficient application of useful resources efficient and effective application of all the useful resources a company must try to create those four attributes v r i n and if a resource exhibits v r i n type of characteristic then you can assume that the resource will enable the firm to gain the advantage and if the firm is going to gain the advantage over others then this view rb view argues naturally it's an argument and as long as the argument is valid your research is valid your research is acceptable and the theory or the model or the framework will stay valid or the rb view will stay valid as long as that argument holds and the management scholar accept that view so this our this rb view supports that organizations should look inside the within the organization inside the organization what are the unique strengths you have remember toes and swat within toes and swat the question is threats and opportunities are outside the organization rb view asks that you should focus on the internal environment in other words what are your strengths and focus on your weaknesses try to develop those strategies which are based on your strength because you are the one who have these strengths nobody else will have so instead of focusing on the external environment remember pest political economical social technological outside environment but to face that outside environment what are your strengths within the organization rbu says if you are looking for competitive advantage try to develop strengths within the company and focus on your weaknesses to convert them into strengths and the firm will obtain sustain competitive advantage by implementing those strategies which will exploit the internal strength for example toyota production system tps developed by toyota within the toyota company but it was such a unique way of doing things system that the other leading automobile companies of the world did not have so naturally then tps became a hot selling cake and the companies were asking toyota and now you can understand if somebody is asking that please share your strengths with us there is no free lunch you will charge money and even if when you charge money 
मास्टर इज नॉट गोइंग टू टीच एवरीथिंग वो कहते हैं ना कि बिल्ली शेर की खाला है सब कुछ सिखा दिया बिल्ली ने दरख्त पे चढ़ना शेर को नहीं सिखाया ये नॉलेज ये रिसोर्स ये स्किल इंटरनली डेवलप है ना तो दोज रिसोर्सेज विच आर डिवेलप्ड इंटरनली हैविंग वी आर आई एन एट्रीब्यूट्स इट इज आर गुड बाय रिसर्चर्स मैनेजमेंट स्कॉलर्स दैट इट विल गिव यू एन एडवांटेज बिकॉज विद इन दर बी मॉडल आर बी वी मॉडल रिसोर्सेज आर गिवन द मेजर रोल एंड दीज रिसोर्सेज विल हेल्प to develop the organization performance performance means productivity performance means share of the profit performance means leading role in the market performance means customers are happy satisfied but let me share the last very important sentence with you that when you speak of resources yes VRIN is important but the most important resource is which is intangible it's within you intangible it will play important role nobody can copy because it's within you nobody can substitute because it's with, it's your resource it's your communication skill at the individual level let me speak about you it is your research skill it is your data collection skill it is your communication skill it is your teaching skill nobody can copy intangible so within the rb view knowledge will play an important role because knowledge as a resource is intangible thank you